Hey guys, it's Chelsea and today I just wanted to film a really quick um, Nordstrom Rack beauty haul. These are all pretty cheap items, don't expect anything luxurious here, but I just went and got a few things, spent like $15, but I just went in there to kind of see what they had and oh, I'm in love with Nordstrom Rack. I mean, they have such great deals. You know, they have Tony Burt shoes, Michael Kors. They have some of the most gorgeous shoes ever. Um, and, you know, they have bags and all this stuff discounted. And it's just awesome. So, love Nordstrom Rack. Highly recommend. Um, but anyway, I didn't know they had a lot of beauty stuff there. So, I kind of went through the clearance section. And then I just got one other thing. That's kind of random, but I needed. But anyway, so this is the first thing I found in the clearance section. And this was, wait a second. Yeah, I was going to say, this. there was another sticker on this that said $5.70. But the one left on it says $9.50, but it got reduced. Yeah, I only paid $5.70. Or, yeah, I only paid $5.70. Anyway, okay, and then, yeah, this is regularly $38, so, yeah, <laughs> and I paid $5.70 for it, um, so that's insane, it was 75% off to $9.50, which I would have paid anyway, but then it was on another clearance of $5.70, so that's insane. Anyway, so this is the Stila Skincare Face of the Day. And I was kind of scared to buy it because I felt like I was going to like fall in love with it and then not be able to get it after that and then be all depressed because I'm not going to pay $38 for a moisturizer. But whatever, I thought I'd try it. Um, so basically, this is a multi-use moisturizing gel cream. And I wasn't entirely sure what it meant by like multi-use, but I don't know. Apparently, you can, you, it has multi-uses. I would just use it as, like, a daily moisturizer. But anyway, I've used this once. It's nice. It's big. It's 1.7 fluid ounces. It comes with a pump. It's really nice. And it feels really nice on the skin. Um, I just got it because, I don't know, I've never used a gel moisturizer. I really wanted to get the Clinique one. But I've just never gotten around to getting that and stuff. So, anyway, I picked this up while I was there. And I'm super excited about it because it was only like $5 and it feels really nice on my skin and I actually think I like really do like this product. I've only used it once though, so you know. But um, anyway, so yeah, got that. Real happy. And then I found another clearance item. This is also from Stila and this is their sun gel and this is regularly $24, which oh, is crazy. And I got it for $3.60, $3.60. Um, so anyway, you know, spring break and summer and stuff is coming up, and I've tried the Jergens like, face moisturizing gel, but I've never tried Stila's, so this is their sun gel, and it says you can use it on multi-parts of your body, but this is definitely so small. I think it's more for just your face, because you would blow through this so fast if you used it, like, all over your body. So anyway... It says, it's a safe alternative to basking in the sun. Lightweight gel bronzer creates a flash of faux color and gives the appearance of a sun-kissed glow. So anyway, um, you know, it's you can apply it on your face and then like on your neck and your decollete just to kind of give an appearance that you've been in the sun. So this is also the same amount. This is 1.7 fluid ounces and it comes in this packaging, which is really cute and nice. I have not tried this yet, but I'm definitely looking forward to it. So, yeah, um, really excited to try that out, and I hope it is not streaky and actually looks really good. I'm just kind of worried about the whole blending it out kind of thing because, you know, when you're, like, doing your legs and stuff, yeah, there's, like, edges like your elbows and stuff, but generally it's pretty easy to get an even color, but your face, there's just so many bumps and lines and things, so I feel like it might be kind of hard to make it look, like, believable, but we'll see we'll see um anyway and then this I did not know they sold NYX cosmetics at Nordstrom apparently they do because it's at Nordstrom Rack unless just the Nordstrom Rack has it but anyway so I was looking at the NYX stuff and um I saw this and this is La Le Frou Frou 
And this is their Voluming and Lengthening Mascara. And I got this because, number one, I was almost out of my Maybelline mascara. And this was only $6, which is really cheap. And, um, you know, that's like the same price as a drugstore mascara. So, got it for $6. There's a little thing. Um, anyway, I used this yesterday. I'm not too entirely impressed with this product just because it's a very dry formula. And I think it really has to do with the fact that the opening here, they made it really small. Like the brush barely fits in. And as it comes out, it really strips everything off, which is good because it's those clumps and bumps that in your mascara one that cause like a lot of clumping and things like that on your eyelashes. But also it makes it so the brush is very dry. So you're kind of like doing all this and you're not really getting that much and it is good because you know really wet mascaras you tend to get mascara like on your eyes and stuff like you know blinking and it might get up there so you don't really have to worry about it with this but it kind of sucks because you can't really get that much out of it um this actually worked really well on bottom lashes i definitely noticed it was really easy to like because it was so dry you didn't have to worry about it getting underneath it would just get right on the lashes and make them really long but as far as top lashes it didn't really do too much for me you know um this i don't know i'm not really impressed i didn't see any volume the only thing it probably does is lengthen a little bit but not even not like anything that's like oh my god it gives me so much like it's just kind of like an average very dry mascara so wasn't really impressed by this and it kind of sucks because I'm like so tight on money right now like I really don't have the extra money to spend on products like these that just don't work but you know you won't you don't know that till you try it and then you can't return it so anyway you know I hope you guys enjoyed this small haul I honestly didn't even know this was a $34 product that's why I was so surprised um Anyway, it seems to be working really well, so I'm not sure, because that was like my first time in a Nordstrom rack, so I'm not sure if, like, if there's an item in one Nordstrom rack, it's going to be in another Nordstrom rack, but definitely hit up your Nordstrom rack's clearance section, because, you know, they have great deals in there already, but, you know, the fact that something was on and clearance for five dollars that was originally 34 is amazing so i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know what you think in the comments below and i'll see you next time here on makeup by chelsea bye